check your email. My assistant would have emailed you a couple informations, like the, the business name that you're going to set up, the phone number, um, and the category. Um, in the email, there's also a link to create a new Gmail account. So first, let's do that. Enter your first and last name here. Um, for the Gmail username, come up with a username that kind of resembles the business name. Um, so for this one, for this example, it's Motor City Towing Service. So I'm going to put Motor City Towing Service. Okay, that works. If that's already taken, obviously you can put like various numbers in here. Okay, so what I want you to do is take notes of, it, of this stuff and save it somewhere safe in your computer, okay? So we don't want to lose the account information. Create a password. I'm not going to record it here, but make sure you record it for you guys. Put the password and save it locally somewhere safe in your hard drive or your computer. The birthday. Don't enter any phone, uh, mobile phone number here. For this current email address, you need to enter the same email address you um, used to contact us or the same email you filled out in our um, job survey. That's most likely your personal email address. The reason why we need to put like a legit email in here is because sometimes when you log in from different locations, Google will ask for a verification using the backup email you entered here. So this is something that you have to take note of. Um, backup email is this one. Hit next. Okay, so the account has been created. Now we're ready to create the Google map listing. So go here at google.com forward slash places, Just sign in, okay, so what's the name of your business? So refer back to the email that we sent you for the name of the business, okay. This example, it's going to be Motor City Towing Service. That's going to ask for an address, enter your address here. The reason Google asks for an address is uh, Google wants to know that you are the true manager of this um, social media account and that each of these business social media account on Google Maps need an address. Um, don't worry, your address uh, will show you an option to hide your address. Your address will actually never be seen publicly. But we need, do need to enter your address that you filled out in our survey because Google will send you a verification letter that's going to take about three to five days to get to you. And once you get the letter inside, it's like a five-digit verification code. And um, once you do, you need to, we need to log back into this account and enter the verification code, and then the account is verified. Only then this account can be used. So this is an important step. Make sure you fill out your address accurately here and make sure you check this okay I deliver goods and services to my customers and also this hide my address okay this is gonna ensure that your personal address will not be online it'll be hidden okay deliver um, in person within distance of business set this to 50 miles Business category, refer back to the email. We would have told you the business category. In this case, it is towing service. 
We hit next. The phone number, this needs to be the business phone number that we emailed you, okay? Don't put your real phone number in here, okay? We emailed you a phone number to put in, so do that. Leave the website blank, hit next. Hit continue. Okay, postcard by mail. Enter your real name here because this is what the, the postcard letter is going to be addressed to, um, to your name so the United States Postal Service can get the letter accurately to your house. Double check and make sure this address is correct. And hit mail, okay. Okay, it'll say postcard is on the way. It'll take three to five days. So we're done for now. I'm going to show you what the Google postcard looks like so you can keep an eye out in your mail uh, mailbox okay it more or less looks like this okay it'll be a little envelope and inside is a five digit code okay so also once your um, once it says postcard is on the way um, email my assistant reply to that email and say um, say Google verification letter is on its way once you get the letter in three to five days, log back into the account and enter the code. And then once it's verified, email my assistant, let my assistant know, and then we will pay you immediately $25 to your PayPal account. Um, and then we will give you your next tasks that you can do for us. All right, thank you very much.